Okay, this how-to video is going to describe how to create a hierarchical block inside AllCAD Capture, which can be really useful when you've got um, a repeatable circuit and you want to draw it just once and then use the hierarchical features of Capture to be able to replicate that several times. So you can see I've got a, a schematic page here called AMPS page one. This is the circuit that I want to replicate um, and I've got a top level schematic that is just blank at the moment. So I want to tie these two together and create a hierarchical block. So I use the, the place command, place menu, place hierarchical block. I then give it a, a reference, so let's call it AMP1. Um, the implementation type will be the schematic view. The implementation name is effectively the schematic folder over here, so you'll see that I then get AMPs as a selection. Um, now there is an option here, path and file name. This is specifically for if you wanted to use an external link to a different DSM, but um, when you're using the design itself, uh, you don't need to set this. So we'll just click OK you'll see the crosshair changes and I can then go and draw the box that I need. So if we look at this, there's all the hierarchical ports that are available. Um, if we go to page one, you can see actually there's all the hierarchical ports. So the two, we've made a direct link. So let's just adjust uh, the position of how we want to draw this block maybe. And we can just literally click and drag these around to suit. We'll just rescale. I'm happy with that block. Now what you'll notice is when I double click and descend this or go into the hierarchy it takes me to that specific page so there's now a dynamic link between the two and I can also do a right click ascend hierarchy to go back between one and two. When I double click on the page it's going to take me to that page. Now if I wanted another instance of this I literally just use the select control C control V that now gives me a second instance that now gives me a third instance. Now what you notice now is I double click into here I'm looking at the different pages if we go back to the, the, the root level folder, what I can do is I can double click here and I actually get a list of the three different instances or the occurrences that I have that are available for me. So I can go to the AMP3 and you'll notice that the reference designators are the only bits that's different between the three parts.